is good chat in today's video we have a couple debuts i want to do so let's get right into this so <clears throat> it's i'm debuting trout but it's not really because i i haven't debuted him it's because he's supercharged he has uh seven home runs or a home run streak in seven games and uh yeah, so he has a home run streak. Supercharged. You have him P5. He's 125 across the board in terms of hitting. I'm not really doing too hot with him. I'm doing okay with him. So I figured we'll try out the supercharged lad. Uh, I wanted to give Jim Tomey a look, so he's going to be playing third. He's probably not going to be the best third baseman, but he'll be good enough. Um, Everything else is still the same. And then we're going to be taking a look at Alec Manoa. The uh, the thick boy from the Toronto Blue Jays in the all from the All Star game. So yeah, so we're gonna give him a look and we'll go from there. All right, let's get into this. Oops, we won last game pretty easily. Unfortunately, I don't like easy wins. I I like difficult wins. But anyways, let's get right into this. All right, let's see who we're going up against. Alec Manoa. I think we could be home. We got Trout in the three hole also, by the way. We're facing P5 Noah Syndergaard. Interesting. So we're not going to be getting a lot of hits. He has Willie Mays. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, he probably plays a lot of ranked. But anyways, let's see. We're, what is it, 18-11? Yeah, we're 18-11. He's 61-64. and 64. New York Yankees. Alright, so we got another Yankee fan. I think that was what we were facing before. Was a Yankee fan. Earlier today. Alright. Let's see how we do. So just about set and stepping in. Juan Pierre. The speedy Juan Pierre. The pitch. That one finds the zone, and we are underway. Left hand batter waits. Bunting for a hit. Garrett. Not in time. Damn. He bunts his way aboard to lead We almost had play. that. I'm not going to lie. Here we almost had Aaron that. Judge. And what a two way player. Not just offensively, but as good a defensive outfielder as there is in the game. Owen, two as he waves at that one. I mean, wouldn't you more or less just call and Judge a five tool player, strikes. if not the best five tool player? Here. Not a two way player? I don't know. But that's just size. In there for strike one. Tis just I, I guess. First with one away. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. Got him swinging. Ah, I threw that a little too high. Here's a speed. Sorry. Willie Mays. Swings through that one. That was a beautiful throw. It just wasn't good enough to uh, get him, you know, get him out. Ah, that's going to be a run. It's all right. No biggie. Well, he found himself it's one run in the count right there, but he didn't give in. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel. Damn, he has six home runs straight with it. That's great work right there. Jordan Walker on the swing, oh, and two now. And just to touch on May's defensive ability, there isn't a ball he could go. Tommy, the last out, yes, sir. Thought, All right, so we're down one nothing, no biggie. Let's see what we could do in the top of the inning. Good contact guy, good defender. 
I don't know if he's going to like intentionally, unintentionally walk Mike Trout or try to get me pitching or swinging at stupid shit. I don't know. But hey, Charlie got a base hit. That's all that matters right there. I was like, if I'm going to do anything, I should just fucking let it go. Just take the single. If you're that base runner, second base, you want to be quiet out there. Not bouncing around, not distracting your teammate. That oh, now this ball gets down. RBI double to tie the game. Michael Nelson Trout. Let's go. So now it's the four hole hitter, Jim Tony. He's walking Jim. Okay. I respect it. Bringing it up Aaron Judge. And the force play is now in order. Well, it doesn't get much easier with this next batter, but I totally understand going with the intention I understand. Of in that spot. He's just too dangerous at the plate right now, and there's a base open, so it gives you options defensively to get an out. I wasn't gonna say that. I was actually gonna say I understand it because you know you get the four, you get the double play potentially more easily. Sliced hard but foul. But the way I see it is, wouldn't you rather just face Jim? over judge because judge has like p5 power but obviously tommy doesn't anywho kind of sad i was lied to about how good ellie de la cruz was but then again, like I always say, not every card is meant for everybody. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. I don't know how that's not a grand slam. I, I need someone to clarify in the comment section how that's not a grand slam. Like, that's... Uh, if that's not a grand slam, then I don't know what else would be. Eh, eh, it's whatever. I'm walking Maze. He's been... Maze has been like Barry Bonds to this kid. With the bases empty and one out. Willie Mays has been Jordan fucking Walker Barry Bonds for this kid. I'm not fucking yeah, taking a chance. No way. Here's the pitch. Run around the goal. Next offering is fouled back. Kicks and fires. And he chases that one. Twelve punch outs. The batter now, Javier Baez. Fuck it. I'm gonna i I'm gonna go with the full nine innings with Manoa. Swings through that Screw it. I don't care. There goes Willie. Swing and a miss. No, Johnny. How, bro? Johnny. Johnny. You're the best fucking catcher in baseball. I'm sorry. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. I wasn't even paying attention. Fucking bozo. I'm sorry. That's some fucking bozo shit, bro. Like, what the fuck was that? So fucking annoying. One swing, you can tie up the ball game. But if you're patient and work a walk, then you bring the game winning run to the plate. What the fuck? I'm so lost, bro. Either one, something off speed. Good arm action on it, whatever it was. Pay off pitch. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. The pitch. Ripped on a line. I think that is cap. That's one thing that pisses me off about this game is no matter how hard you hit something, it, it doesn't always result in a hit, but it should sometimes, not all the time. Ryan Stanek. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Like if that was if if anything, that should have been a base hit, but it wasn't. For whatever fucking reason that may be. Like, I, I got a lot of unlucky swings in this game, and it's kind of unfortunate. I, I, I am going to take a look back at that fucking Ellie De La Cruz one, and I feel like a lot of people sh would agree that that probably should have been a grand slam, if not a fucking a moonshot. Or at least a double, maybe. First offering is fouled off. It definitely should have been something more than it was. Wings through that one. That split and, you know, what are you going to do when you get a lucky win? You know, you, you fucking, you think you rule the world. I, 
I think I should have won this. You know, I'm not going to complain. It's, there's no use in it when SDS is literally worthless. A SDS can't even fucking make the game right. I'm not taking his runs away, but he knows. Him and I both know that Ellie De La Cruz hit a grand slam earlier in the game. And, you know, he should he should respect that. And he knows, he, he knows that. So, anyways, guys, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.